It's beginning to look a lot like Vlogmas. Love that. Good morning. Good morning, everyone. It is 8.30 a.m. on Monday morning. We we were like, we're going to F45 this morning. Well, like this is our thought process every morning. We always have to drag ourselves there. But we were like, okay, Monday, we're getting up. Because we skipped uh, Saturday and Sunday. Okay, so we were like... 8.30 workout and we're on our way and I'm like oh let me just sign up really quick just make sure and I'm like there's no 8.30 like why can't I sign up so I'm like refreshing and <laughs> we like go into our email and the schedule changes for like holiday week there's no 8.30 class I knew the schedule was changing I did too I saw the I email. just didn't think the 8.30 class would be the one that would be next because that's usually me the most too. popular class well, I the saw the email this weekend. And I was like, oh, schedule change is okay. Close Christmas Eve and Christmas, like thinking, just scanning it. And it didn't, I didn't even see yeah. that 830 wasn't there. Well, we, we anyways, no, no class. No we're class. To say. We were halfway there. And we were like, <clears throat> so, so we, we're up. <laughs> we were like, let's go to maybe one of the later classes, 1215 or 430. Yeah. And get our day started. So That'll we're, be good. we're going to Whole Foods to get some eggs. As you know, we're going to yes. make our breakfast sandwiches. Yes, we are. It's so weird, like, to get yourself up. I mean, thank God that we have those workout classes. That gets us up. That's what I was saying the other I mean, day. Once we have a baby, though, and that'll get us up. But, like, dang. Yeah, having For this us. as, like, the beginning piece of our structured day is, is. key. It's so key. All right, let's roll in. What else oh, do you want to get? Oh, by the way, I'm besides? drinking an E-Rose cold brew. It is so good. Um, what else do we need? Just like some nibbles for the week, like before we leave. We're leaving Thursday to go see the Hunter's family for Christmas. So just whatever we need, like little snacks until then. Should we like, mm, I don't want to get too crazy. Should we make like a dinner or two? When we decided we're going to fly. Mm -hmm. We have flights for Thursday, but we're considering maybe driving. Mm. It'd be nice to stay away from all the people on the flight and playing with all the everyone's sickness going sick. on. I feel like Nashville, we went to um, the store last night to get some medicine because we were out of Tylenol and I was getting like really bad headaches. My throat was a little sore. And everything is wiped. Everything in the cold and flu section, you guys, was sold out. It was like everyone in Nashville is sick. Yeah, it's everyone, everyone everywhere is sick. Everyone in Texas. No, I know. We talked to your parents and they said a lot of people in California are sick. Everyone's sick. It's just wild. It's wild. Things going around. It's just the time of year. It is. But it's COVID, <laughs> flu, strep, cold. All of everything. Above. Everything. I don't know. I'm kind of convinced that um, winter, like, think about it. I think you're just supposed to, I think your body goes in cycles. Like, think like Native American vibes. Like, with the seasons, you just try to respond to the weather. So, like, when it's cold out, you stay inside a little bit more, you rest more, you, I don't think it's meant to be this like go, 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 go season. Mm -hmm. So when everyone's out and about at Christmas time trying to like do much stuff, it's like our bodies are all like, ah. So you're saying we should have Christmas in, in the summer? No, I'm just saying like, I think I've been, I've I'm been kidding, kind of I know. putting pressure on myself like, oh, I'm like slowing down, but I think winter time you're supposed well, to slow down. And also you're pregnant, no, so of course you're slowing down. Right. Yeah, I agree with you though. I think we all are like, oh, I need to keep going at the same rate that I've gone all year long. Yeah, and it's just and it's meant like to no, be it's cold. Go inside, like hibernate, light a Sleep fire, have more. some coffee, have some hot cocoa, calm, watch some shows, read a book. Yeah, just mellow. Exactly. Oh, just mellow own TF it. out. Just own it. Do we want to make like a dinner or two? Um. Oh, I need to get my tea at. The we're gonna be here for for three days so we should i know i want to get a couple at things least like one i want to get a couple things out of there as well yeah maybe like one dinner what should we make label label that's just a good solid yozu okay. it's healthy and we'll call it that and then we'll probably and then we'll either go out tonight grab chipotle oh, one night yeah. and then yeah. yeah yeah okay cool um are we going out tonight by the way i woke up this morning craving those sandwiches from smoking oak Oh, did you? Yeah, yeah it was and really I, I want to get one good. before we go back. Okay, I'm down. Say no more. That would be really good to grab on the way to the airport on Thursday. Yeah, and just have that at the airport because it like fills you up too. That was a dink. That was so good. It was so oh good. Oh my god. 
Well, good morning, you guys. Okay, good morning. It's Monday, 8.30, Chipper. Let's go. We're feeling good. Like We're we feeling, should. Yeah. This is pretty good. It's so good. Oh, yeah, okay, so this is cold brew with date, cinnamon, coconut oil, vanilla, vanilla. cashew milk, and cinnamon. It is, is so good, you guys. I'm thinking a fun cheese could be cool. Let's see what they got. What it's kind? Like the smell over here is appealing. <laughs> um, oh, you know what we could do is like a um, no truffle. I would. I don't think that's gonna be good. Yeah, like Havarti is good or <clears throat> let's see. Ooh, what if we did like a white cheddar? You know that one that you got? Was it like this? Like that white cheddar and it's like yeah, lots that, of flavor. That's, that's pretty good. Oh, I wanted to get that Merlot cheese that. Right there. Right there. Right here? Oh, perfect. This is so good for snacks. Pregnant snacks. This cheese right here is the, so uh, good. Sartori. Merlot It's cheese. this same one. It's the same one. So this one is the Merlot. It was that's the best soaked though. in Merlot because it has the wine flavor. Because but this one's good too because it ha it has the uh, oh herbs. Rump, the herbs and well, you know which one you got the Tennessee whiskey. I didn't like it as much. No, it's like but sweet kind of. That's so but good. But the cheese inside is like technically the same. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the rind makes a difference. Yeah. Okay, we need. Uh, I think we're good. We're good. Thank you. Mm, these are good. Fig and olive. Let's get some of those. Ooh, apricot fig and lemon oh, crackers. Okay. Thank you. Uh, yum. All right. She said three chili pepper gouda. Perfect. That might be a nice. That sounds on a great. Sandwich. Yeah, totally. Let's get that. Welcome back to another mukbang. The sauce we made was. A little bit of mayo, half an avocado, green hatch chili sauce, or chili salsa, and pepper. It's good. Yeah. Mm. What? Have? I just got you breakfast. And then I have three spiced gouda and cheddar on mine. You just have cheddar. Mm -hmm. Little Cholula. I mean, it looks pretty solid. We lost the bacon that we got at Smoke and Oak. <laughs> we couldn't find it couldn't after find all it. that. So maybe he didn't pack it in the bag. We think that they left it out because they um, rung it up wrong at the store and they had to like pull it out to like rescan it and I think maybe he didn't put it back in the bag. Yeah, we searched for it forever. But we luckily had another thing of bacon, mm -hmm. but it just wasn't the fresh bacon from that farm. That we thought. Oh well. Mm-hmm. Pretty solid. Mm-hmm. The bread's pretty thick. It's hard to cut. Who came up with the concept of a sandwich? Genius. I'm gonna leave shortly for our workout. <laughs> mm -mm. You already had breakfast, bro. Absolutely not. Sandwiches are 10 out of 10. I would like for this to digest before we go. We'll figure it out. Alrighty. Fast forward two and a half, three hours. Believe it or not, we're still in the same spot. <laughs> but we just got home from at 45 with the 1215 workout. Yeah. And it was. Great. It was we much needed. needed it. Oh my god. Needed it. We are doing Christmas shopping today. It's getting close to Christmas. Yeah. And I hope everyone's feeling the Christmas cheer. Feeling joyful. And excited to spend time with family or friends or loved ones. Yeah, I'm excited. We, we hope you all have a Merry Christmas. But we are going to do some final Christmas shopping at the mall. Yes, we are. And we want to do some shopping for ourselves too. Well, we didn't get each other gifts this year. No. Or we weren't really planning on it. We don't really do that because it's just like, oh, what do you want? Okay, well, I'm just gonna. Yeah. You know. For sure. I was thinking, yeah, I mean, what? I think I it... would maybe like a new bag. Okay. That could be fun. I was thinking that we could go on like a little trip together. Like a little, like basically our Christmas gift is like a tropical <laughs> trip somewhere in the new year. But if you're gonna get a bag, I'll just go on the trip by myself. <laughs> Oh man, you bought cowboy stickers. That's <laughs> as much as a bag. So. Yeah, you're going to that too. Actually, you know what? We well, can't. Get I can the, wear we the can't bag. Get the bag because we got cowboy stickers. I can wear the bag. So that's unfortunate for you. I, I mean, for years. Okay. We also decided to treat ourselves today. 
and go to a reflexology place and get like those foot massage. They're basically foot massages. Yeah. They do a couple other areas as well. Are we starting with massage or starting with mall? I think we start with mall. Okay. And we call the place to book appointments. Book appointments. Maybe you can bump your meeting up to like 4.30. It's noon today. Let's maybe book appointments for like 1.30. Oh, 1.45. Like two. Or two. three. Are you looking for any specific items? Um, I need one gift for one of my secret Santas. Oops, me. You need one gift for one of your secret Santas? Yeah, and then just stuff for myself, like comfy pregnant stuff. Okay. I want um, some like more turtlenecks, some, I want to get a puffer coat. Are you going to Aritzia for that? Yeah, I'm going to do an Aritzia swoop. Oh, I'm tired today. I'm gonna drag me out of bed for a workout. <laughs> you always blame me. I know. It's a dang side show. You don't have to go. You can say no. I should have not gone. It was I don't. It was so stupid that I was there because I was so tired that I didn't even try. But we I was literally stretching during some of the stations. I was like, I don't want to do this. We went to sleep at 9:30. It just wasn't. I know, but I. It does. How many, how many hours get did, did your aura ring say you got of sleep? I think nine. I mean, that is, that's gold. I know, but I feel really tired. Like, I need, I need, I just know that I can't go at that rate. <sighs> you think overall I just feel a little worn down, which I've said multiple times. I'm really proud that I've started to let myself sleep. Me too, I'm proud of you. But I, I still notice, even though I'm letting myself sleep more, I'm still fighting it. It's weird. Yeah. Why am I putting up a fight? I don't know. That's your personality. You should give in. I know. Okay, well we're on our way and we'll bring you guys shopping with us. We're gonna get a few items. Yes. And see what we find. Here we go. Ladies. This is cute. Sweater dress. Might be a weird length, but I like it. It's nice. I like the knit. I'm gonna come back for that. I don't wanna carry it around, so I'm not gonna do that. Can't find my turtlenecks. I saw these, but they have a cutout on the back. It's like open back, but good ribbed mock neck. Here's a Wilfred one, ribbed. It's nice. White, but that one has some makeup on it. Green, black, I have a black one at the house, so that's a good option. Oh, I've been wanting these jeans. They're like a trouser jean by Citizens and Humanity. But I don't know if I want to buy them while I'm pregnant because I'll probably not like fit them for a while. So that's kind of pointless. Um, let's see. That's cute. Oh, that looks expensive. I'm like a designer. It's really nice. Okay, I want to find a sweater dress, like a maxi one. Jackpot. Okay, these are the ones that I love. Babaton. Babaton everyday mock neck. Yes. Uh, so it's not long, but it's not crop per se. Okay, I love that. I love a cream one. I know all my size, of course. I have it in black. Okay, so it looks like the only color they have is beige. Oh wait, what's over here? Let's see here. Medium, I guess I could do that. Small, perfect, cute. And a chocolate, I need a chocolate. Uh, it's a large. Oh, this is the one annoying thing about Aritzia. They always are sold out of shit. It's so annoying. Just like, have the sizes, please. We don't want to mess with it. Uh, I guess I could do a medium. I'm really liking shit like this right now. Jumpsuits. I think as I get more pregnant, these will work. Um, this is a pretty color. But it might blend in with my skin too much. Could look naked. These are cute. I wish it wasn't so cold so I could wear short versions. That would be nice. I would just die for a nice pair of a gray sweats right now. I need them so bad, but of course, they don't have shipper sizes in store. This is very cute. This is the closest thing I've seen to the free people vest. 
They have it in black, but the beige is really cute and they have it in large, which is what I would want. It's really cute. Kind of want that. It's really thick and like nice quality too. It's really nice. You can go get that. Okay, I'm at Abercrombie and I wanted to get a long puffer, but they only have large and then black. I don't want brown. Okay, well, looks like that's all I got, but they are 40% off. I've been wanting this sweatshirt. This one. So this is a medium. Perfect. Yes. I've been wanting this. This is super cute. This onesie with the ribbing. It's so cute, but that's super flattering. I've never tried any of their activewear, but I bet it's pretty good. I have not been in Zara in a hot minute, but I don't know if I want to touch this with the 10-foot pole because the line is always a disaster. Oh, it's such a mess. That's cute, though. It's a cute little simple dress. Oh, I just don't know if I can deal with this. They might have a... Um... Well, that's cute, too. Look at that. Simple. They might have a puffer, but... Oh. Can I deal with this? I don't know. Yep, they have a puffer. I'm too lazy though. Oh, I can't do it. I'm like, do I just get one when I'm in Texas? These boots are amazing. Oh my god, these remind me of those boots I have from Zara a couple years ago, the red ones. Oh my god, those are absolute perfection. They're like kind of a western vibe and the heel is not that high. Those are perfect. Those are the most perfect boot ever, pretty much. I'm gonna look online for those. Uh, adorable. I actually have a lot of good stuff, but I'm just not in the mood to mess with Zara. Okay, I'm at Free People, and I love this coat. It's so cute, oh my god, but I'm like, oh, I don't know if I should buy it. It's just like, Christmassy, but it's like, can you wear it past Christmas? I don't know. Long, and it's fleece on the inside. It is so cute. And then look at this vest. This knitted, like, kind of shawly vest. How cute is that? So, this would be the two things I would buy if I just don't want to be excessive. I can only pack so much. I'm exhausted, you guys. If I'm just tired at 17 weeks pregnant, like, how tired am I gonna be for this goes on? I think I was just in like, to like in Vegas, I didn't get enough sleep last night, I'm like moving like molasses. I can't be here much longer, I'm so tired. Um, but I found some good basics, some things that I am needing. Hey, where are you at? Oh, oh, okay, I was waiting. I came to the seating section outside of Nordstrom, I thought you were there. That's okay, okay, I'll come meet you at the car. Oh, okay, bye. Decided to go get a smoothie, clean juice, you need a juice or a smoothie? I think I actually want a smoothie. That sounds really good, actually. That sounds so good. We're the suckers that buy uh, these every time we go into a place like this. Yeah, I like them. technique it was like this like you know when they like pinch it yeah. and it's like not like a good technique they just like but I mean it did relieve it but oh, how was yours it was good yeah it was good not hard enough no it might it might tickled my feet a little bit oh it tickled a couple a couple a couple times. <laughs> Wait, what? We're like, Tell me. like I fell asleep but it woke me up a couple times because I was like yeah like it like you know it that was like whoo yeah like yeah, that yeah, little yeah. tickle feeling that's funny um, but it was good. It was really good. I feel like we had the owner guys, which they're usually like the strongest, so you do want them because they yeah, like kind no, of like sure. F you up. I like <laughs> the like, deep yes. hard. Like, give me, I mean, if you have a jack hammer, bring it over. I know. But you know what I noticed? They never like, go that hard on the feet. 
I'm like, I want you to go, don't go so hard on my shoulders, go so hard on my feet. I also don't like, and his wasn't so bad today, but I've noticed it before, is sometimes when they have like longer fingernails, yeah. and they're like massaging you, you can it feel their scrapes. fingernail, and I'm like, that. Mm. the itch isn't what I'm looking for. I'm looking for a deep massage without your fingernail touching. You know what I That's very nitpicky, but. <laughs> you know what I also noticed in those places, <coughs> like, I don't know why, but consist consistently across reflexology places, the, the guys are always like burping while. <laughs> I know. Remember that foot relax ball? Okay, y'all. The one in Prosper. It was called the best foot relax. Oh like my that. god. How many of y'all were here for that? Leave a comment down below. That was terrible. They were literally, they were literally like, like <laughs> the entire time. Yeah. Yeah, my guy was doing that today, and I was like, I heard mine. Just a, wait, maybe. I heard mine a couple times too. Yeah. I also wonder if it could be like the energetic release. Uh, I don't. Know. Like, come on, member like pain. Pink. Ping is our massage therapist that we had at our acupuncture place and she's obviously, acupuncture is all based on energy and everything and she did the massage there and she would like point out to you like she would literally like be massaging you and it's like TMI but she would like massage at your leg and then she would like, the, the energy would move through her body. It, that's what she and said. she would burp. At yeah. Least. And, I, and I, I believe her. And so yes. that could be happening with them, but like. She says the energy from like massaging you, it moves through your body to her body and it has yeah. to come out somehow. And, yeah. and usually it comes out in a burp, is what she said. Yeah. And she said sometimes she'll like pass gas. <laughs> she yeah. said that. That's crazy. But you know, energy's a real thing, I think. Yeah, it's a little. It grosses me out. I don't like talking about No, that. I know, but that's, you know, it's interesting. Um, okay. So we're headed home. Um, we, okay, today is Tuesday. Yeah. We are planning, we have our flight to Texas on Thursday. Yes. But we're considering driving. We kind of have a wild hair. Because there's a lot of like bad weather moving through the U.S. as a lot yes. of y'all know. Storm is And coming. we don't want to fall into a situation where we get stuck at the airport or flights get delayed or canceled or something like that on Thursday. That would be terrible. And to avoid that, we're considering just like leaving <clears throat> early and driving. So we're considering maybe doing that tomorrow. That like is supposed to happen too, you know. I know, I know. So like we might. As and well a lot of our friends that. were gonna leave tomorrow, but they're leaving tonight to beat avoid some of the that. storm also on their drive. Yeah. And so, I mean, what time is it? What time would we get in? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I mean, we can stop somewhere on the way down there. Yeah. We could start up in Arkansas, like Little Rock, and then wake up and have like a nice little four and a half hour drive in the morning. Oh my god, how nice would that be? Yeah. Okay, I'm well, down for that. It might it might be nice to just have like our bags in the car. I know. And like we can kind of like it'll be easier to pack have that way Well, because I also really wanted to pack my wrapping paper, and I was like, I'm not gonna put that in a suitcase. I mean, in that so case, we, we should drive. If you want to bring your wrapping paper, <laughs> because we I, I, Juju needs a wrapping. We're paper. driving for Juju's wrapping paper. <laughs> well, you know, we bought it all, and I was like, "Dang, you're not even get to use it because we shipped all of our presents to wrap at to our my parents', parents house. house." And I'm like, "When we get to use our wrapping paper." Um, Anyways, <laughs> okay. Well, let's go home that's and assess. That's a decent option. We need to figure out Booker's thing. Yeah, Steve's at home. Okay, and also, just so y'all know. We would love to take Booker to Texas with us. Like, we would love that more than anything. Yes. But, once again, another family member, my mom, is highly allergic to dogs. Like, yeah. she's the worst, actually, of, in terms of being allergic. She's super allergic, so he can't come and so inside. And so we can't have Booker inside the house at all. No. And it's supposed to be so cold there, so the only option is to leave him in my parents' like little barn on there. And there's, like, nobody for him to play with when he's there. And we obviously we'll walk him if he's there with us, but he pretty much would just probably like, sit at the door all day in the backyard. And we just, like, don't know if he's used to that, so I'd rather him be with his friends on the farm. Having a slumber farm Christmas party. What are the options? I think he'll, he'll like the farm. I know, but it would be nice to drive with him. It'd be so easy. I'm craving a Chick fil A salad. Okay, let, okay, let, let me call my parents and see if there's some, any way we can bring Booker. We need to figure some stuff. Alright, we decided that we're gonna leave for Texas tomorrow. We decided we're gonna leave pretty early in the morning. 
So I just showered up. We've been throwing the frisbees with this guy. And then some exercise. Mr. Gordon Bombay. Bombay. <laughs> um, and yeah, and we're just gonna, I'm pretty tired. Yeah, we're just gonna start packing up now. Yeah. So For tomorrow and leave early. And we'll do a little Q and A um, on the road trip. We yeah, put up a box on Instagram, and so we'll film that. We're gonna order some food, get to packing, yeah. and um, oh, I'm, I'm actually I'm kind of tired. I'm tired too. I'm ready to go to bed right now. Yeah, I like to get packed. I, I think know. here's the here's the reason why I made the executive call to leave tomorrow morning instead yeah. of tonight is I want to make this like a peaceful leave yeah we're gonna be gone for six or seven days i know a week and so i want to make sure this house is left in good, condition. in good condition we're not forgetting things i know and we're not just rushing the pack and throwing crap in a bag i know and and we can get a good night's sleep tonight i know i think that's important especially with our we're sick. yeah we don't need that we always just force it what are we doing i don't know i'm wild and out um okay for this giveaway entry, it's the second $1,000 giveaway. Mm -hmm. um, raising the stakes on the money, so we're raising the, the amount of things you have to do for the <laughs> entry. Yeah. And like this video, leave a comment, and then go over to Instagram, and we have a photo that we shared of our pregnancy announcement. It's just a photo. Go leave a comment on that photo. And like, like it. it. And share it to your stories. Okay? So, five steps. Or seven. seven steps. <laughs> we'll put it all in the description box. Like this sure video, everything. leave a comment on this video, go to Instagram, like the photo, leave a comment on the photo, and share it, share it to your stories. I guess it is five things. Yeah. Why do I have seven? I don't know. I'm gonna have to rewatch that over. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, go do those things, and that's how you enter today's giveaway. And there you go. Good luck. Y'all have a good night. We love you. Bye. Bye.